Um, Eric, I just spoke to Graham Potter, who believes that a draw was probably about the right result. Do you think the same? <laughs> yes, that's what I said. I think it's a fair result. Um, I think it was not right when we sh should have lost this game, uh, uh, especially first half, we dictating the game. We had uh, we created really good chances, I think three really good. And then uh, he make a transfer and system, uh, uh, gives us some difficulties, but I think uh, de uh, defending-wise uh, we, uh, uh, we sorted good out. But on the ball, second half, we were not that good as in the first half. And then uh, you could see the goal. Huh? But just for end, and if you then fight back, so then I have to compliment the team. Yeah. How frustrating was it to concede that penalty? Because obviously it was a clear foul from McTominay. Have you spoken to him about it? It's uh, when you concede a goal, so just uh, before end of the game, uh, that's uh, uh, really disappointed. But uh, when you then in the end uh, fight back and you come off the pitch uh, with one point, and I think then it's a well-deserved point, and then it's, I think for the long term, it's a really good point. You had some chances at goal from, uh, certainly one from Rashford, a couple from Rashford. It just say, it seemed that, that United were like lacking that cutting edge, that, that finishing that we saw against Tottenham. How frustrating is that for you as a manager, and what can you do to, to rectify that? Uh, I think it's, it, the good point is we're creating the chances, and it's an, uh, it are open chances, and we will finish them. Um, how is Varane? Do you know? Do you have any update? He looked bad. No, I don't know, but of course he's emotional. In the moment it happens, I think now we settle down, but we have to wait 24 hours minimum to get the right diagnosis. And when you looked at your bench, there didn't seem to be a great deal of attacking threat for you to be able to change the game in that way. And obviously the question will arise, Cristiano Ronaldo. And I think most people think that you've made a very strong stance, but how frustrating is it to not have him at your disposal at a situation like this? Uh, we don't have um, Martial, we don't have Cristiano Ronaldo. And there are two offensive players uh, who scored the most goals. Um, so you miss them, but uh, we had to do it because standards and on the longer term it's more important uh, to set the right culture and also in the team process uh, you need uh, to control the, the standards and values. Thank you for talking to us on Astro. Please. Thank you.